Hey guys, we are back with another craft. This craft is an acorn ornament. The fun thing about this one is there might be a hidden surprise in it once it's finished. So for this craft, you are going to need an old Easter egg, spray paint if you don't want the color of the Easter egg. I used That's silver and you. gold. Something in there. All right, here's yeah. your gluey thing. Oh, look at all those papers to glue and cut. Okay, here's the scissors to glue and cut it. All right. Easter egg spray paint if you want it a different color. I did silver and gold and some yarn. Now to get the loop part, you're going to want to put glue all That's over like the fat end of the egg and loop it up so that you have space right there. This part gets kind of tricky and wobbly and it's kind of weird, but if you stick with it, it should work. Okay, now I've got the short end is glued onto the egg here, and the long end is attached to the other end of the ball of yarn. I'm going to take the long end and start spiraling it around the outside. Let's see if I can show this to you. Um, so I'm covering the short end of the tail and I'm pushing it down onto the glue as I go. Get it on there nice and good. All right. Any color that you want your acorns to be. I picked mostly kind of natural colors for mine. Look. Oh yeah, you got the glue stick all the way out. Um, except for the blue one. I'm gonna give that to my sister because blue's her favorite color. And her whole tree is decorated in blue and silver. All right. Why I'm choosing to show you the acorns. Acorns are a good fall decoration. If you live near an oak tree, you can see them on the ground. At the very end here, you're gonna wanna cut it and just mash the end of it into some glue there so it doesn't unravel all your hard work. Acorns Whoa. are an amazing food source. I love how God created everything uh -oh. for us to use. Yeah. yeah, your glue stick is kind of out of control, huh? Um, but do not eat real acorns. They are not edible for humans, not without a lot of work and cooking. So I'm not sure how the indigenous people of America first figured out how to eat the acorn without getting sick and dying, but they did, and they use it in acorn flour and all sorts of things. Animals. Acorns are an amazing provision for animals. I'm gonna let this dry. While I'm talking to you, I might just do another one. I have a different kind of string here. Um, animals, acorns. You'll see a lot of animals, like squirrels and stuff, just eating the acorns. I don't know what's in their tummies that can make them capable of doing that. And you will see um, woodpeckers. Woodpeckers will take the acorns and put them into trees. Now you might think that they're saving it, their winter storage. That's not really what they're doing. They use the tree kind of like a refrigerator and they put their acorns in the tree hoping that the bugs will find it. Now, when we put our food in our refrigerator, we are hoping that bugs do not find our foods. We don't like bugs in our foods. But for the woodpeckers, that is precisely the food they're looking for. They want to eat the bugs. Let's pause it. So we will, they will hide the acorns in the tree 
and they'll let them sit there for a while until they start to like rot and the bugs find them. And then the Can woodpeckers have, Can do some more, hold on. Please? I'm not quite done yet. Good words though. An amazing stash food source for the winter as all these bugs come and try to eat their acorns. Here you go, whoa, here you go, there's your glue. You need to put stuff on top of the glue though. It's not enough just to glue stuff or to glue the page, you need to put paper on it. Are you gonna tear and cut your paper? That's enough. No, not enough yet. All right. <coughs> Temper tantrums are so much fun. You have enough. There's a brush to use, and you have paper to put on it. I don't want to do it. I our, to use it. Our craft time might be finished. I hope you have fun. If you want any supplies um, for this one, yarn or Easter eggs, let me know. I've got them at the church. I will happily find a way to get them to you. Bye. <laughs>